Hello everybody, welcome back to Nick's Shooting Channel. It's been a little bit of a slow summer on the videos, I apologize that, but today we're going to talk about the Ruger American Pistol. As always, first we have no magazine. Magazine's right here with no live ammo, and uh, you can see the chamber is, is clear, so uh, firearm is safe. So I just picked this firearm up today, and uh, I just want to kind of go over my initial thoughts. Have not shot it yet, so um, first is what it comes with. We have the gun plus a uh, two 17 round uh, magazine, so the firearm 17 plus one. I got the other magazine upstairs. Comes with this nice uh, hard case, and you can see there's two additional back straps that come, so kind of you can tailor it to the uh, size of your hand. Uh, here you have a larger one and a smaller one. These little red things are just inserts to kind of stop it from collapsing on itself when they're not in use. Um, of course, you have your gun lock that comes with any firearm here and a whole bunch of paperwork. Uh, tells you how to use the firearm and uh, whatnot. And a bunch of disclaimers. You also get this nice uh, hard plastic Ruger case. So, a couple other interesting things that maybe I haven't seen so standard in new firearms. One is you have this uh, Torx wrench. I believe it's a T10. And we'll show you this in a little bit, but you use this to change the back strap. And then also you got this little guy here, and this is just a empty chamber indicator. So this, I believe, can slide right there inside your barrel. And uh, you can see that the firearm's safe. So let me take this out and then what we can do is uh, we'll have a little bit of a close-up here on this firearm and go over some of the details. To take it down you got to lock this slide back with the slide lock and this little lever here has got to come all the way down. Now one thing I'll show you that I've noticed is if your magazine is in it does not want to come down so um, all the way. It's spring-loaded so take the magazine out and all the way down and this should just slide forward real nice and spring and barrel so there you go real simple to put back together barrel in spring in sorry it's a little tricky doing with the camera in front of me and uh, just slide that slide right back on the frame now one thing I'll show you that also that I notice is this is not going to go up if your slides not back so you need to lock Get this all the way down, lock that slide back up, and release. So another thing you have here is this uh, back strap, and there's a T10, which you got to use this for, and it's just a quarter turn, and it's a little uh, sensitive here that I've noticed. Um, once it's turned, and then your back strap should just slide down, and uh, out. Now the only uh, thing so far in the few hours that I've owned this that I've noticed is I have this other back strap here which is the larger one and it's real tough to get on there so I might need to put some oil or something on there um, but it doesn't want to go on all the way and it just doesn't doesn't seem to fit right. The time I did get it on here and I'm not going to slide this up it was real hard to slide back down. So I think it's meant to be easy, maybe I just need to work on it, but I'm going to leave the medium on for now. And again, you just kind of get it on there and then slide it up, and once it's in place, quarter turn. So uh, full size 9mm, um, like I said, it's basically ambidextrous, you got your uh, mag release on both sides. You do have kind of this... Uh, trigger safety here in case you drop the firearm that needs to be depressed for the firearm to go off um, yeah so we'll take it out to the range tomorrow and see what we want or how it does we'll do a little dry fire here and you can see here I'll go nice and slow for you so we'll just see where a little bit of take up there and reset and boom the last thing I'll say is it's got these uh, nice Novak sights on there. Um, the only, a little bit, not really even complaint that I've heard is the way that these are kind of on an angle here. If you wanted to go down the side of your pants or something to rack the slide, uh, you can't do it because it just slides right off. But um, yeah, it's got these, these Novak sights. And uh, I was looking at a SIG P2 
320 it's a few hundred dollars more i'm sure the trigger's a little bit nicer maybe it's a little bit nicer firearm but it's a few hundred dollars more and uh it wasn't in stock so um, we went with the ruger american pistol and pretty soon you're gonna probably have a video of me out at the range we'll uh we'll see how we how we do with it um and you can notice here no need for the magazine to be in in order to uh depress the trigger and fire it so um, there you go. Again, thanks for watching Nick's Shooting Channel. As always, I appreciate the, the views. Um, comments and thumbs up are always appreciated. And uh, feel free to leave me feedback, subscribe, pass the word along. Have a great day. Mm -hmm.